Execution by impalement. It's one of the most horrific methods of execution. Suleiman al-Halabi, who came from Syria to study at al-Ajhar during the French campaign led by Kleber, died this way. The occupation broke all boundaries. Suleiman was filled with intense hatred and animosity towards the French campaign and decided to kill Kleber, learned his whereabouts in the Azbakeya area. Disguised as a beggar, he sat at the palace gate unnoticed. He bought a 20-inch dagger and waited for him to come out to the garden, where he stabbed him five times until he died. They held a trial for him that lasted four days and decided to execute him by impalement, which involves a pole fixed to the ground with a sharp metal tip. He was seated on it, and it tore through his entrails until he died. They left his body for the birds and animals to ravage. His skull was taken to a museum, labeled, The Criminal Suleiman al-Halabi. Was he a criminal or a national hero?